Welcome, welcome, welcome to the vlog. Uh, better late than never, right? It's 4.54. Uh, went and did class today, everything went fine. Stuff up to par. The intro to aeronautics class, it's actually really interesting. They had the Kent State flight team come in today and um, talk about their thing and how that works. And it looks like it's going to be a really interesting course. So I'm glad I picked that up. I've got another story about yesterday about that class that I'll be telling you about uh, tonight, probably. So I'm on my way now to the bank. I gotta stop real quick. And then I'm gonna meet my mom and sister for dinner at a new restaurant in town. Everybody else is eating there. I haven't gotten around to it yet. It's called Three Palms. It uh, went in a couple years ago. Well, a couple years ago it was um, San Francisco oven, which was really good. They had pizzas and subs and stuff like that. It's right downtown. We used to eat outside. We used to eat there a lot in summer, probably like once a week. Uh, I can remember parking the Ferrari and the smart car and we'd meet the grandparents there. And then it closed uh, July 29th, 2009. Don't ask me why, I remember the date. It closed June, June 28th, 2009. It closed and it did not reopen as this new place until a few months ago. It took forever. So now it's open and I'll let you know how it is. I've been following this chotch in the town for the last 10 minutes. 35 means at least 35. No, 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 not to her. We went 20. And now she's going to take a very wide, slow turn. Look at that. The speedometer's down to nothing. Into, uh, I guess that's a church there. So there's friggin' churchgoers don't know how to drive. Maybe that's a bit of a blanket statement. But now I have Hudson traffic to deal with. Yay! Holy crap, guys, can you see that sunset? It's actually really pretty. It's 5.53, we just had dinner in there. It was good. I wouldn't say it was great. I had a margarita pizza uh, with basil on it. The basil was really good, but they just kind of put leaves on it. I would have, would have preferred if it were uh, maybe cut up a little bit and dispersed better. Um, so yeah, that, that was dinner. I would go back. I might try something different. I did have a brownie for dessert there with powdered sugar. It was excellent. Highly recommend the brownie big times. But uh, back to that sunset, it's it's kind of disappearing. It's in the mirror now. It's really nice. It kind of feels like a, uh, a spring, early spring night downtown. It's only 36 degrees, but holy, that is a big bus to be going through town. Typical traffic issues over here. We got this guy sitting there in uh, what looks to be a CRV. Don't quite understand. And he's gonna be on my way. Okay, he's out of my way. Good. Check it out. We can kind of see some of that uh, pink-ish salmon sunset and our moon up there. It's beautiful. Oh, that is beautiful. I love that wallpaper. Anyhow, it's that time of the day. It's 1.30. AM. I just uh, worked with Colt for several hours trying to figure out problems with the car. And the CPS sensors came, put those in. It's uh, still suffering from an idling issue where it, it actually won't idle. Um, before it, it would do that, it would be sporadic, disconnect the battery, reconnect the battery. It seemed to do like a sensor reset and then it would work. It's not doing that anymore. So mass airflow sensor didn't fix the problem, nor did two new CPS sensors, all OEM. BMW parts. I'm still finding Christmas needles up there. Um, so now we're thinking it's the... What is it? It's like the... Oh, come on. I, I, ICV. Something... Uh, let me think about that for a second. You can tell I'm tired. Idle control valve. ICV. Problem is, we can't find it on his car because we think they changed the technology and that part isn't there. It's in the form of something else. Uh, we don't think it's a vacuum leak. Sensors seem to be good. There's no codes that have thrown the service engine soon light on, so it's kind of a kind of a head scratcher. I don't know. I said I was going to tell you a story about classes on Tuesday that I now have to go to tomorrow. It's late. I want to get this done. I want to get to bed. So I'll tell you tomorrow. I promise I won't forget. It's an interesting story. So um, that's going to be it for today. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Thursday, last day of classes. We have three. Sociology. Um, <laughs> understanding architecture. And then the third one is a new one, and we'll talk about that tomorrow, as I said. So, good night. I'll talk to you on Thursday. Good night. Again. Good night.